PT Distinction has set up a new team feature where you can set up your own team of trainers and manage them all from under your one account. Each trainer has their own account and their own login. They have their own clients to look after and you can share anything you like with the trainers in your team. What I'm gonna do here is just take you through how you set it up for yourself and add some trainers to your team, assign clients to your trainers and share coaching items with your team of trainers. So to get set up, just come up and click on your name. Then go into manage my account. Inside manage my account, click on team leader account. And then tick the box to make this account a team leader account and save changes. What you'll notice is a little pop up comes up here and you can expand this. And this is your team admin. This will follow you around wherever you go inside PT Distinction, whether you're in your trainer account or in the team admin area. It's a little shortcut to go into any team members accounts and have a look and see what they're doing or to go into the admin area. So I'm going to click on team admin. and then I'll close the widget down. And what that does is it opens up your team portal. It shows you that you've got one trainer in your team at the moment, so that trainer is you, and you've got 98 total team clients. And that would be your current online clients. You can click on either of these to view your trainer list or your client list, and you can add a trainer by clicking on Add Trainer. So I'll quickly do that. Now you set up their email address and put in their password at this point. Your trainers can go in and change their password at any time if they wish to. Save that and your new trainer is set up. From here, you can go to their accounts. You can remove them from the team or you can edit their details. If you remove a trainer from the team, you'll be able to select another trainer to take on their clients. So there's no worries about losing clients or losing any information when a trainer leaves your team. So by going into account, you just go into their trainer account exactly the same as your trainer account. And we will visit that a little bit later in the video. To assign your new trainer a client, just come up and click on clients. You'll notice that at the top, this is very similar to the main dashboard when you're working as a trainer, but this is your team portal. To change from trainer portal to team portal, just use the access widget here. So here you have your client list and you can search for a specific client or you can just find a client in the list. Under the action dropdown, you can go to that client's dashboard or you can change their trainer. By default, you are their trainer because you're the first one to set them up. You can change the trainer by clicking here. Select your new trainer. And then by leaving this box ticked, all of the content in that client's account will come across with them into your new trainer's account. So any programs they've got, any assessments they've got, anything else will come across with them to their new trainer. This just lets you know the details of what will happen. So you just click on OK. And that is now moved over. So you'll see under trainer that their trainer has now changed to your new trainer. The other really exciting thing you can do with this is share content amongst the trainers in your team. This is a very, very powerful feature and I will show it to you now. So click on sharing at the top. And it will give you a list of everything that you shared with your trainers. To share something new, just click on share content. From here, you can use the search to find a specific item instantly, or you can use this folder system underneath. You can share any of your program templates, assessment templates, coaching templates, form templates, any of your groups, results tracking, custom exercises, and custom assessment tests. So I'm very quickly gonna share a group, and I'll share a welcome pack. So here's where you can select who you share it with. For now, don't worry about all friends. 
This is just an opportunity to share with other trainers who are members of PT Distinction if you wish to. All team is all of your team and selected is a selection of exactly who you want to share with. So we'll go with all team for now. You can write a description of what the item is that you're sharing if you wish to. And by clicking this box, you can allow further sharing. That means anyone that you share this item with can share it with other members of the team or other trainers. If you untick the box, then they won't be able to share it with anyone else. At this point, you can click send to send out an email, letting the trainers that you shared with know that you shared the item with them. For now, I'm gonna click no thanks. And you'll find that that now comes down into your list of shared items. You can click here to edit who you share the items with if you wish to. Now we're gonna see how you go into your trainer's accounts and see what they've been doing. So come up to the widget and you can select either yourself, that will go into your trainer account or your new trainer. So I'll click them and it will take me straight into their account. You'll see that their trainer account is exactly the same as your trainer account. You can view their clients, you can go into their client's dashboard, you can have a look at any of their templates or groups and just look through it in exactly the same way you would look through your personal trainer account. When you share items with trainers in your team, it doesn't just go into their account because otherwise they might get flooded by lots and lots of repeat items and you don't want loads of groups and loads of templates with no particular order. So in order that they know what they've got and they choose what they've got, they can come up and accept any shared items. To do that, they just click on community and go to team and they can click on your name. They'll see all the items that you have shared with them. In this case, we'll go to the welcome pack group and they can copy that into their account. Once that's copied into their account, it will be there for them to use with any of their clients. So for example, if they add a new client, they put in their details as normal and be able to add them instantly to the welcome pack group. And that is how you add trainers to your team, how you oversee the trainers in your team and how you can share content with them. It's a very, very simple system, very easy to use and very easy to manage your team of trainers for all of your clients and allocate clients to whichever trainers you feel best suited to those clients.